it's amazing to see the support that she has. First on Fox, a mother of four accidentally killed by police gunfire. Well, today San Antonio comes together to help her family. Thanks for joining us this evening. I'm Zach Hedrick. Fox San Antonio's Amanda Henderson brings you the latest in the investigation and how you can help her four kids as they grieve their mother. She was loved. That's, you know, that's who she was. Nada Tirarina was 29 years old, a mother of four, including a three month old baby. Her older sister says she was a light. She was just the most outgoing, like happy person. And she was do for everybody, you know. There was the last thing, last dollar to her name, you know, she would donate it. Or, she just did for everybody. She made everyone laugh on the daily. On Monday, Nada's husband, 28 year old Angel Sanchez, was in an armed standoff with SAPD at this Southside apartment. After pointing a gun at officers on the ground, three officers on a nearby roof opened fire and hit him. He survived, but the gunfire hit Nada inside the apartment. Her youngest sister says her death is difficult to comprehend. It was shocking to me. Like I said, I, I couldn't even stay inside the house. I walked out and I had to take a breath. Chief William McManus promises a full investigation. Earlier this week, he weighed in on what they know about her death, which has been ruled a homicide. Bear County Medical Examiner performed an autopsy this morning, and while they cannot yet conclusively state that Nada died from uh, as a result of the officers firing on the suspect, the physical evidence appears to support that conclusion. Today, the family focused on raising money to give Nada a proper funeral and help her children. We're getting a lot of people um, showing up for her, you know, friends, family, um, a lot of people that knew her. So we appreciate the community coming together for her. She would be really happy to see that, that her children are, are loved, you know. And the good news is, is when we were there, they told us over 600 plates had already been sold. The family saying that Neda was also a domestic violence victim, as you saw in that poster. It's something that's a huge problem in San Antonio. Now, if you couldn't make it to the plate sale, but you want to help the family, we do have a link to the GoFundMe page at FoxSanAntonio.com. Mana Henderson, Fox News at 9.